What does the BISC DAO mean for contributors? The changes are both massive and minor at the same time. Massive because contributors will actually start getting paid. BSQ will no longer be a line item in a spreadsheet, but it'll, it'll be actual BSQ that you can sell for actual Bitcoin. Minor because the process of submitting compensation requests and proposals will only change slightly. You'll still be creating new GitHub issues for compensation requests and proposals. The difference is that you'll also file parallel actions in the BISC DAO. So you'll basically make new proposals and new requests in the BISC DAO and then link to the issues that you created to explain them in more detail. And of course, voting, instead of voting on a spreadsheet or voting on GitHub with thumbs up and other reactions, you'll now vote in the BISC software with real BSQ where stake and reputation gets taken into account. And for more details on these processes, we've got a video walkthrough and a written walkthrough uh, linked in the video description to see more about how that works. And if you're interested in contributing to BISC for the first time, now's a great time to start. Uh, with the launch of the BISC DAO, you can make a contribution and be compensated for your work. As always, developers are welcome, uh, but non-developers are also welcome. If you are a writer or a designer or if you have a background in marketing, there's much value that your skills can have to the network. So uh, I'll include a link to the contributor checklist in the description below. It's a great place to start if you're thinking about contributing. I'll also include links to the Twitter, Slack, and forum, which are places that were most active. And yeah, take a look, reach out. Whatever your skills, it's very likely that you can help. So we'd love to hear from you, your ideas, your suggestions, and don't hesitate to reach out. We'd love to hear from you.